What up YouTube, it's your girl Corey Bella here and this is going to be a earring review for the Deliciously Hot Accessories and she is located here in Chicagoland area. Um, I was happening to be watching one of Di Miss Diamond 34's videos here on YouTube and if you guys don't know her, she is like a earring kind of source. She loves earrings so um, I just was watching her video and I came across these earrings and they were like big and gaudy and I was like wow, where did she get those from? So I'm just going on kind of a wild goose hunt trying to find out exactly who this person is. I'm like, I ain't never heard of him before. Anyway, long story short, I go um, on the page and I see these kind of green and pink earrings. And at the time, I was looking for some earrings for, I was looking for not earrings, I was looking for something to buy my friend's girlfriend because she she purchased me a ticket to Houston to surprise my friend for her birthday. As you guys know, I was in Houston like two weeks ago, two or three weeks ago. And, um... Right, so I was looking for something to buy her. So I saw these pink and green earrings, and I was like, oh my God, that'll be perfect, because she's an AKA, so I was like, that'll be perfect. So it was like the night before I was getting ready to leave for Houston, so I had to hurry up and try to contact her, and was like, let her know that I wanted to get these earrings. And keep in mind that these earrings are usually handmade, so she had to hurry up and kind of get me something together before I could miss my flight and all that type of stuff. So she was really accommodating. Um, and that day I met her like the day I was going to Houston on my way to the airport to pick up the earrings so she was really really accommodating and trying to hurry up and work with me so um anyway we wound up having like a little issue with the order or whatever so I um told her about it and there was no problem she was so sweet about it she was so nice and hurry up and she's like you know when you get back just contact me and we'll work something out so she, she stuck to her word and when I got back um she offered to send me you know three other pair of earrings which she did and I want to come and share with you guys so each one of these earrings I believe is between nine and fifteen dollars if I'm not mistaken her Etsy is closed down right now until the 25th of February so you guys can check out all of these earrings if they're still available but um I will leave all her links below to her Facebook, her Etsy, and her YouTube page. The first pair of earrings are these. I cannot remember the name, like I said, because her Etsy is closed. But these are some really, really cute ones. I got my friends these, but basically in a different, I think it was a different shape. They run straight down like this. I really, really like these. These are not heavy at all. They're really cute and statement piece earrings. All of her earrings that I have are statement pieces, and I don't think that you should wear something crazy on the clothes or crazy, crazy makeup because the earrings, really they really speak for themselves. I have a picture of me out in these, so I'll, I'll post that picture. Yeah, these are really, really cute. I'm loving these. They're not heavy at all. They're pretty good material. I can't even tell you what type of material it is, but I like it. The only issue I have with these earrings is that these parts right here kind of opened up. And I think I might have something to do with glue. The glue might need... Uh, my need to add some additional glue or whatever. I'm sure that's something that she probably can fix. Um, I'm just, that's probably something she can fix, but that's really not a big problem to me because all I'm worried about is this part staying on. So, if you really not like messing with it, you really can't see it at all. So that's not a problem at all. But um, these are pretty cute, really simple, but really um, statement piece earrings. The second pair that I have are these kind of. I don't know what to call it. I don't want to say cheetah print, but they're kind of like an animal print, I think. Type of puzzly type earrings with a um, diamond pattern on the front with chains. So these are these. And once again, these are not heavy. I think these earrings are a little intimidating because they're so big. And you probably think, oh my gosh, they're going to pull my ear. But no, they're, they're don't, they don't. I love the chain detail. I think next time to go a little crazy for the, for the springtime, I think I might order another pair of these. But I might get like whatever these two colors are, I'll do, do a different color chain just to add a little bit more funk to it. So these are really cute. And um, you won't find anything else like these, I don't think. So really cute, light felt. I don't know if this is felt cardboard. I don't know what this is. It's kind of a light, soft material. But I don't really have any, any cons pretty much to say about these. Everything pretty much looks, you know looks like it's in place and this is what these look like and once again I'll insert a picture ouch I didn't have any in all way y'all but I'll insert a picture I don't have my way in but I just want to show you guys what they look like on I would definitely wear my hair up with these because I have my hair down and you don't want your hair to get caught up in these earrings and you be turning and they turn with you The last pair that I have are these really pretty pink and yellow lightning bolt earrings. And these are made of a foam material. Really creative on her behalf. 
and then they have like these little uh, diamond mirror type of um, right but they have these um, little cute details on the top and these are extremely like you guys know about foam material this probably was really super easy to make but this is super creative as far as using different materials a lot of people use glass and crystals and metals but she used foam and this is really creative and super fun for the springtime so I'll be excited to wear these during the spring really light material you guys I'm just going to show you guys what these look like I haven't worn these out yet so um, I'll just show you guys kind of how they look on I think I have them in the wrong ear, but you guys get the idea. Really cute. And I think you can get all these earrings in different colors, you guys. She, she hand makes these these uh, earrings. So, there will probably be no problem in getting them in the different colors and stuff you want. Just make sure you ask for the, the right name. Like I said, her Etsy is close um, until the 25th, which is... What is that? This weekend? Cause today is, what, the 20th? So, I say that. I think before Monday, I think it's the 27th. Um, the 25th of February, guys. Her shop will open back up, but I'll leave her Facebook and everything below so you guys can check out um, other types of earrings that she does have available. And yeah, pretty much check her out. Her name's Andrea. She is located here in Chicago. Um, she's a super sweet lady, very accommodating, and I really like um, working with her. And I look forward to more business with her in the future. So you guys, please let me know if you guys get something from her shop and leave like a video response or something below if you guys do purchase something. And till I sent you guys over, if you never heard of her. So thanks, Ms. Diamond 34, for putting me on to her. I'm so glad to find her. I love supporting people in my city. And it's so much easier with shipping and all the other type of stuff. But thanks again, Andrea, for um, getting me out my pieces. I really like them. And that's pretty much it. So if you guys have any questions, leave them below. And I'll talk to y'all soon. Peace.